In this video, we're going to look at some of the report options that are specific to roll goods. So, of course, we can look at a color summary, which will include a gross quantity and a net quantity. So the net quantity, again, is the size of the area. And the gross quantity is the amount of material you need and a waste percentage perimeter. And then on the right-hand side, it will have a length as well as the width of the material. So you can print that, the color summary. You can also print a key code summary, which just lists your products and has a floor plan. You can also print a fitting plan for each material. So I'll select that. For each material, it's gonna list the net and the gross waste perimeter. And then it's gonna have a seaming layout. And then on the next page, it will have the roll numbers and the length. So you can match those up. So it's gonna be easier to see if we go to a material where we can see the seams. So carpet six goes in the guest room so we can see those seams. And if we zoom in on the plan, we can see that each roll has a, a cut number, a room number, and a cut length. And then on the next page, we'll have a list of those cuts and a total at the bottom. This also includes filler list. The next report we're going to look at is the roll cutting sheet. So this gives you a map of each material. So let's look at a few pages. The material is listed at the top and then the cut map below gives each roll and the length and then the cuts. And this can be paired with a color summary or another summary with the cut number, the room number, and the cut length so you can match those up. Another thing we can do is add product images to roll goods as well as to tile. And to do that, we'll go to the material editor. And for a roll good, you're just going to select pattern file and browse, go to support and select a product. This is going to change the pattern repeat, so don't use this for your quantity, but you can print out a plan with the product images on there. If you'd like to get rid of these seams, you can change that in global settings. I'll uncheck dis draw seams only and uncheck display seams and thicker pin and requantify. and we'll get the product image on the plan. So then you can print your reports and it will print with the product rendered on the plan. That's it for printing reports for roll goods. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments and thanks for watching.